Hey everybody, how you doing? And welcome. My name is Oscar Ramos. Welcome back, everybody. Well, today I want to discuss with you what's happening in the cryptocurrency market. Once again, we're less than 1.90 trillion in global market cap. That means that the price of Bitcoin, Ethereum, Crocon, even ApeCoin, 17 now $14. It's all making it very difficult for Kronos ecosystem to balloon. And you see right now on the screen really clearly, this is MMF price. And what you're seeing right now, well, we just experienced a nice sell-off in the last couple of hours. And well, I know a lot of people are like, once again, really, from almost $2, less than $1, then $1.20, $1.20 something dollars, and now 94 cents. In my opinion, guys, what an amazing Christmas present, right? You see right now on the screen at the bottom, all of the ones that we've been covering in the channel that we like, that we enjoy, that we're farming passive income on the side, baby, and they're down. Man, this is going to be hurtful, but it's all right. This is what it means to become a cryptocurrency investor. If you like this, go ahead and smash the like button, subscribe, and turn on those notification bells. So now, let's have a conversation, everybody. Why is this happening? Well, a lot of turmoil, a lot of things going on there. I mean, it's just what it is in the cryptocurrency space. But guess what? A lot of positive news going on, but still we don't see the prices just going all the way nuts. And it is what happens with all the whales holding on and still the supply of Bitcoin getting smaller out from the exchanges i love that so don't let the prices right now intimidate you scare you don't let the thought get to you right i know i'm just a guy here but i've seen it work 10 years ago bitcoin balloon all the way more than 10x so i believe we can do that again with the good projects and mmf and tectonic and vvs and crypto.com chronos are part of that crew okay so what's happening right now with MMF? Well, does that mean that are we just panic selling on this one? Absolutely not. This number was 1.60 something a couple of days ago, I believe yesterday or so, because of the sell-offs we see now is 1.50 and it's been going around. I like it, honestly. It's more than 1 billion to my opinion. I mean, it's not bad at all. It's the highest TVL by everything in all marks. It's going to do very well, but right now we're experiencing more sell-offs. Even the stock market, I'm just showing you this really quickly. Dow Jones, S&P, Nasdaq, Russell, really down. And I did some comparisons, everybody, and all of them are down in the year to date, starting 2022. They all have negative returns. So, man, what a 2022 we're living. This is great opportunities for us to dollar cost averaging entering at a cheaper position because later on it's going to be much late and later on i want to sell off to make some profits so this is what's happening everybody closer back again to the thirty-nine thousand. we're just going around in this price channel so let me show you this is crocoin so we went over we crossed to that position to the price channel that i have now at 40 cents and bitcoin cross over to the forty thousand and even lower if i'm going 42 today this is today all the way to the thirty-nine thousand. right so that is more explanation for me to show uh, to share with you that if we go lower than uh, in MMF, it's totally fine. It's absolutely fine. That is a message that you, that you gotta receive, which is totally fine. I mean, not gonna make sure that I'm not gonna panic, not gonna start selling anything. When it comes to the technical analysis right here at the bottom of everybody, my relative strength in this is going to the oversold section. I mean, it is great. I mean, great opportunity on my Bollinger Bands in the on the day. I mean, short term, if I make it to the one hour, I mean, it's going to be seen even higher that it's already oversold here on the stochastic and the other side. If I my, my, my MACD is going to be showing red on the Bollinger Bands, I'm going to move this one away. It's already down in this, you know, lower part of the of the ranges. If I go to the 15 minutes on MMF, which I know a lot of people are looking into this. Now we're seeing how people are trading this, buying and selling. That is the beauty. You know, there's maybe trading bots. There's maybe people that just do this for a living and they're making good money. But us, I mean, as investors, maybe we just want to hold. When we look at the day, right, which is, I think, what I go for a lot. I'm going to go ahead and adjust this for everyone. The cheapest price uh, on the 15th of this month has been 63 cents, right? Usually... For these cryptocurrencies in protocols for, from Kronos, they really range from the top all the way to the 78% retracement price level here on the Fibonacci levels, right? On these levels that you see, they go at those levels and they stay there for a while. I wouldn't be surprised if I see MMF at those levels, which that will imply MMF at a staggering price of 50 cents to 20 cents. 
all the way to probably 80 cents. So a nice, beautiful range. I'm going to bring my marker of this pretty much around this level. Now, would that happen? That is not guaranteed, but looking at how things are unfolding, we might you know, be aware that that could be a possibility having some prices around the 60, 70, 80 range area for a while. If I see the price, prices consolidate down around these levels, in my opinion, there's just no better way to getting into these prices. I'm iffy a little bit to get an MMF passing $1.20. I believe it is still really high when it comes to that price based on what we're seeing at this time with the current volatility. There's a lot of volatility because there's a lot of uncertainty as far as what's going to happen with the price of Bitcoin and Ethereum if we're going to experience more sell-offs, right? So that is normal. We go here right uh, right now, even, you know, just to give you more examples, Terra Luna, it was close to $100. Now it's down 5% to 90 back again. Don't forget about Terra Luna. What about Shiba Inu? All the gains that he had with Robinhood evaporated gone, mostly gone. It's going to go down to 4 zeros 22 and that's it. I mean, the reality, right? Great news for the entire Shiba army. I'm part of it, but it is gone, right? Kronos, all those great news that we have thus far, back to the 40s. And I have something special for you. Are you, are you ready? Let me show you this because I'm going to uh, close this so you see this very well. So what we're seeing right now, the most traded native tokens on Kronos in the last 24 hours Everybody wants MMF. Everybody wants Grab Crow because you can change it for Crow. And then down the list, this is all one, two, three, four, five. These are MMF ecosystem and it's dominating. Then, of course, Dark Crypto actually passed VBS. And well, you see Tectonic, which is right here. So this is Dark Crypto ecosystem, VBS ecosystem, Tectonic, uh, which is, you know, at the far right. And then, of course, MM Finance dominating Kronos, right? So that's what I'm doing, passive income. That's what I'm getting on right now as so I get more Crow. The new strategy is to make a lot of money in the future. So that's what we're seeing right now. This is what I'm I'm putting myself to, to earn, to make money. Because I know this market seems so ugly, specifically for MMF, that there's a lot of hope for people to make a lot of money specifically on the vaults. I mean, I haven't checked it, but let me go ahead and do it for you live. Let's go ahead and go to the vaults right now. And oh, baby, it's going to hurt to see those APYs, right? Just to give you an idea, I mean, everything's fearful. Everything's down. So don't be surprised. This is what happens. Embrace the volatility. Let's go, baby. No worries. So here it is. This is going to load. And please tell me. Ooh, 1,400. Okay. It was 2,000 a day or two days ago. So you see how easy it changes. It changes so fast, so fast. Actually, this one went up. Yeah, this one went up. <laughs> because MMO is, is doing not bad. I'm happy because I'm going to do this one for, for my passive income strategy with Grab Pro. This is insane, right? So there's the deal, everybody. Even though we're done in some, we can celebrate and cheer up on some other growth news that we're referring in this video. Thank you very much for watching, guys. We're down. Now you know why. Now you know the levels. But it's all right, everybody. Just long term wins the game. Like, subscribe, turn on those notification bell, join the Patreon page, ask me any questions. Peace.